what's going on everybody hope you guys all had a nice memorial day we're gonna try and explore a little more on island lake i know it says smithville but um i didn't feel like changing it <laughs> so we're gonna try and get a little bit more scouted out here i really want to get the other vehicle the actual scout out here and be a little faster but might have to switch over to the other map and see if i at least can get it over there and then we'll uh, come back over here, try and get some of this opened up. So let's see, I think I want to go into the garage again. And then get our scout out here. So now that we know we have garage spots, let's go over to see if it's in here or not. I don't know where it would be. Let's see. So it's not that one. So we want to go over to this spot here and let's get the, this one here. There we go. So let's do that and then we'll get that out of the garage and get it over to um, get it over to Smithville. Where's our time at? I can't see it because it's covered. Afternoon, evening, night, morning. Um, I wish there was a faster way. Let's see, we probably want to go towards the dam. What's going on, Sleepy? How you doing, buddy? More visit, more, oh, I see. I thought that was uh, actual, someone followed. How you doing, buddy? I'm going to actually bring my scout out now and get this thing over to uh, that other uh, um, over to where are we at? I forget what, whatever that other place is at. I'm a little tired today. Well, not tired. I just, we played a little longer than I thought I was supposed to play last yesterday. And then had, um, had to cut, go outside, cut the grass. And then my neighbors had us over for a few minutes before I had to go to bed here. So I can't remember what, what map we're actually on. Since it was uh, something little, something other. Little Island, I think it's called. Uh, we gotta go way over here. Lake Island. I thought it was um, faster to go the other way. I mean, it probably is still faster. But just go down this road here instead. Crap. Yeah, it's all, see, I wish there was a way to fast travel right to the gateway. If I go this way, it's pretty ding. I, mean, I guess it's not as bad either, too. I don't know. We'll try this way. Do your kids get, um, well, the little ones probably don't see it too much, but do they get uh, a little afraid from the fireworks, or do they like the fireworks? I'm sure you guys are probably having a whole crap load of fireworks right now. In your neighborhood. Luckily our dog so far hasn't got too afraid of the fireworks. There's like no easy way to get uh, over to this other area of the map. Like I know this part isn't as easy to drive but it's probably the faster route. Your, your son has no clue, yeah, and then your daughter is iffy about it. Yeah, the wife, I mean, last couple of holidays, the wife said that the dog really wasn't too bad. Our other dog hated him, man, she'd be afraid um, when, you know, the loud fireworks were going off, but this one seems to not be too bad.
I'm hoping I'm going the right way here for this. I don't know what the right way would be right here to do. Let me go through here. If I don't map this out, man, I'll be lost because I don't know these maps very well yet. All right, let's see if we can get that. Plus the, the stupid, so we only get 22 gallons in this thing. Like I almost want to take the little uh, trailer, but I know once we get across there, the fuel trailer that we got here, um, there's plenty of fuel on the other map, but this map doesn't have as much fuel. Yeah, I can't remember what that, that one guy was saying yesterday about the Chevy pickup. That, that I, because I sold one of them, but I didn't know there was more than one. I don't, but I thought they looked both the same, so. Like, well, it's already gone. <laughs> but at least I got, well, I got fuel on the top rack there, too, and a tire, but. I know this thing, man, you can barely get to the other, the other gateway and I'd run out of fuel and there's no fuel up there. I, I gotta be better at moving some of these trailers around with, you know, fuel trailers around so that I can have somewhere to refuel these things or fix them. I wish I would have done, um, so like, I saw a video with uh, Brian that was in here yesterday and he he loaded the pickup up in a tra uh, trailer and towed that all the way to somewhere so then he unloaded it so you wouldn't have to drive this thing all the way over there I thought that was pretty ingenious I didn't know you could do that Hopefully it doesn't take too long to get it over there, though. So I do want to check out that other map, you know, a little bit, and get that scouted. I'd try to get, I'd like to get some of them uh, upgrades and stuff like that. The towers, get the towers opened up. It's just a matter of um, that other vehicle we got over there is too slow, and it shouldn't really use it as scouting. No fireworks at all yet? Huh. I don't know. I, I, I didn't hear anyone before I came downstairs here, but it was just starting to get dark out. It's weird waking back up and it's still daylight. I get I should get stuck in here. See, I thought these tires would be good in here. Alright, let's see if we can... This is the other part that I'm having. So I hit the V to open up the functions. And then you get these little circles, but when I put my arrow over it, it doesn't highlight it for, like, the wench. And if I hit the left button, it turns them off. If I hit the left again, then they turn back on, but... It's like I gotta hit V and have the arrow over it before I can use the wench. And I don't know if there's an easier way to do this. And then I gotta hit V again to turn the functions off before I can actually use the wench. And it seems like when I watched Bearded Bushman or whatever they never have it, it seems like it's so much faster they can like I can hit just the F button and, and it turns on the wench but it seems like they throw the the cable out pretty fast and I, I don't know why mine how it why it takes me so long to put the, the wench out there 
what I'm doing wrong or what, if there's a better way of doing it. See, this is the problem area right here. Going over all this stuff is what it's going to take forever to get all the way over to the other side. Maybe these aren't the best tires to put on here. I thought they looked good because they were like... I don't know if these are the only off-road tires I can buy. Oh, come on, are you serious? This thing doesn't, it's very tippy too. Like it doesn't, compared to that Scout 800, I think that one's a little bit more stable. You think this thing would be running right through this stuff with them tires I got on there? Watch me tip it before I get all the way over there and be pissed. It's the only thing, I, like I said, I hate about this game because I don't want to keep having to upright the vehicle and until I can get that one wench where it looks, appears that you can wench yourself out even when you're tipped over on your side. It seems like I'm going to have issues. At least that's what it looks like it reads for that one an ant amphibious wench or whatever. I forget what it's called. This whole area sucks right here. I hope I can actually cross this here now. I think I went over here. Wherever it has like a lighter color, it looks like that's where it's not as deep. But I never crossed it with a pickup truck.
Oh, your internet went out? Yeah, I was talking to you the whole time. <laughs> No worries. I was just saying how the pain in the ass that whole area was trying to get this pickup truck over there. And you know, I think with these tires that I have, you know, they're like more mutter type tires that they would be better and it just seems like it struggles. this is the only vehicle that I could put really big mutters on except for that Scout 800. It's got them really big like tires but that thing is like all over the road man. It sucks. I drive over on this dry area until we get over down a little more. see like we we were almost out of fuel and I only got I mean I'm I got pretty far I guess but we're still not even cl close to that island lake gateway so I'm kind of glad I did bring this little fuel trailer here I could at least fuel up on it I should have checked to see how much fuels in it and filled it up made sure but I forgot This thing just doesn't handle very well. Trying to stay on all the not so muddy spots so this thing don't get stuck here. refuel it while we're waiting here. Let's see what I was trying to say is so when I hit the V button I open up the functions and then I get the little white dots on the on the vehicle like I see other people throwing the wench out a lot faster and I don't understand if there's something wrong I'm doing. I, don't even, I can't even put the wench out. How am I going to get through this thing? Maybe I can wench onto that tree in front of us. Where's see where's the wench at now? Can't tell which tree it's on.
All right, we got to be getting close now. Oh no, we ain't got to cross this thing, do we? I think we went the wrong way. Say, I don't remember crossing that last time with the other vehicle. That could be wrong. Kind of be getting close here. And yeah, we're not too far away now. Finally. Once I get a pulled over here, I'll see where we're, what we got on our map, which way we can go to get some mouse opened up here. So yeah, I think we're gonna go, we wanted to go over to the other, thing there but I want to try and get um, probably end up going over here and we'll open up these roads here see if maybe we can get to that watchtower I guess Help if I put the all wheel drive on. See, this truck sucks.
try and stay over on the right this time, see if that's a little bit less deep, if I can get over there. Yeah, this thing's this. See, I thought this truck would be better because it has pretty decent tires, but it doesn't really work very well in this mud. And I was trying to go all the way down through that area over there, so there's a I think there's a watchtower somewhere over there. They're just getting that other truck. Ugh. All right, let's see if we can. this from here that, that way doesn't look very good to go with this truck Maybe it should have brought that other scout vehicle. And I don't think I can go, I guess I can go through here. Let's see where we're at on the map. I know I can't go here because the bridge is out. Yeah, no, that's that's why I brought that little trailer because I wouldn't have even made it to this. Um, map with with the fuel that I have on that scout. <clears throat> That's only yeah. It's one thing I hate about these. I mean, I do have fuel on top of the truck there too, but like I was struggling that first couple times doing this just because none of the scouts can make it very far on the map. Like I said, I need to get better placement of of like the fuel vehicles and stuff. Yeah, no, no worries. We'll have to get a 
we'll end up doing it again. It's just once you get your internet sorted out there and uh, you could try doing doing again with the uh, multiplayer. So it's pretty fun. It just my part of mine is like, oh, I kind of want to open up some of this my own, but but it would be nice to have help though, because. I get stuck so much, or I flip over. Ah, oh, crap, I missed the turn, didn't I? Ah, oh, crap, I don't think I'd make it through that anyways, over there. Let's see, we'll try and turn around. Now, if I can make this turn or not. The worst comes worse, I'll get in that other vehicle that we have over here on this map, but I just thought this would be faster. You know, this is the way you're supposed to use it, I think. It just get, keeps getting stuck everywhere. Maybe it's because I got this trailer hooked up to me too, though. This might be iffy here. <coughs> this doesn't look very good of a road. Let's see how far I can make it. That's how I was when this game released. I wanted to experience it the whole while by myself, rolling over all the time and having to recover to the garage and drive way back to heck back where you rolled over was getting aggravated. So I was like, let me get help. Yeah. Yeah, no, I, that's a, that's where I'm at. I mean, I'm getting better where I haven't flipped it as much, but I just wish this, some of it would be a little easier. I mean, I did. I have gotten quite a bit of this done my, myself, though. At least the, the first map there, I was, um, I got like a lot of the, I got all the tasks done, I think, and I started working on some of the missions. And then on the second map, uh, Smithville, I was, I had a pretty decent amount of it opened up. I think, I think, it, well, no, I think it is opened up pretty good. Uh, I just don't, I don't have very many of the tasks done yet. But I mean, like some of these tasks, it take me a damn hour just to do the task. And it's only doing one little thing. Oh, this doesn't look good. no other tree other than that one next to us. This little vehicle sucks, man. I don't know why I took this one. I thought it would be better because, like I said, I had all the better tires and stuff on it, or at least it looked like they're better tires for this type of stuff. Wonder if we could wench on that back one over there. Well, we got this thing here, maybe. I doubt it's gonna hold very well. Oh, well, maybe. 
it'll help if I put it in reverse too. I'm not fighting myself. Yeah, that's what I think, but I'm like worried that I'm not going to have enough fuel to get around here now. I might, once I get over here into this thing here, maybe I'll be able to drop this trailer off. So, <clears throat> maybe you might be able to help me with this. So, when I hit the V button to open up the functions, and then you get these things here. It doesn't always want to pull up where I can use the wench. And I don't know if I'm doing something wrong. Like I got to hit the V button again for it to be able to give you the little circles so that the wench can, you can shoot the wench out. So I hit the V, and see, like when I hit the arrow, and so that my arrow goes on there, it won't, it won't, like now it's, see, now it does it, but like not all the time it does it. I gotta hit the V again. Now, why isn't it now? Now I can't even get the wench to go out. So it's buggy. Okay, I didn't know if maybe I was doing something wrong because I see other people like. Seems like they wench stuff pretty fast, and it's taking me forever to get the wench to go out. I think I'm gonna drop this trailer off in here, just so I can see if maybe it helps us out with uh, driving around. So let's see where we're at in here. There's somewhere I can go. Yeah, that's where I was gonna go over here and see if I can get to there. See if there's something over here I can get. If I can get through now, let's see if it's better without the trailer. It does seem like it's moving better. I forget who it was yesterday, he was saying that it there's a lot more fuel on this map, so maybe I don't need it as much. Let's see if it'll help us getting through all this. Looks pretty damn muddy though. I might just actually get back in that other vehicle. This thing, it's gonna take us forever to go anywhere in this thing. It looks like there's a trailer up here. If I can get to it. Freaking very muddy though. Oh, 
Oh, it's a truck. I think that's the truck that that guy was saying about yesterday, the twin steer. Um, this truck must must have been cowboy Cadillac. Back in the day, now it's a total heap. If you can get it out of here, maybe I can get it running again. Well, I know we ain't gonna get it running with this truck, with this pickup truck. I don't know where our other truck is at, if it's anywhere close. Let's see where it's at. Yikes, way over there. How far? Oh, we're way over here. Could take it up this way, and then we can at least open up this area, too. What's going on, Brian? How you doing, buddy? We're just making a mess. I brought my scout over here, which doesn't seem to be doing very well. The Chevy pickup truck thing. It's getting stuck everywhere. But we did find our twin steer. I just need to get that fixed now. Of course, I don't think that I have anything to fix it with because we used it on that other vehicle yesterday on accident instead of using the service vehicle thing. Bedtime for you? Yeah. Well, you get yourself some rest, man. Thanks again for your your help earlier today. Let's see how much of a mess I make myself into today. I'm trying to get back over to this truck here. See if I can get that thing running. So we still got 41 gallons of fuel, so we might be able to make it over there and fuel up in that little trailer I brought over. This thing at least can get through some of this mud better than the other thing we got. Another service trailer just where I marked? Oh, cool. I'll have to check out. Yeah, I know. That's the only thing nice about this... I needed to take the little trailer though because the scout vehicle couldn't even make it to this island with uh, the fuel that it has on it. Whoa, that's a big drop. We have six trailer on this map. Oh wow. So if I can get that truck running, then I at least can have that truck too. I was telling my wife that I was pretty excited learning how to, um, being able to, hit, you know, about the service bays and the garage that I didn't know about, and then um, being able, you know, switching the parts. I, I know you mentioned it before, or even Bearded Bushman had mentioned it, but I just never knew how to do it. Two small one and one, three medium one and one semi. Oh, cool. So hopefully we'll get back over to that and we can get that thing running. Now if, if there's no garage on this map, then where does it, does it send it back to Smithfield Dam? Or do I have to drive it over to Smithfield Gateway and then be able to... Okay, cool. Yeah, because this way then I won't have to... I mean, there's no... I don't think there is a garage on here, so... So here's the sur... So should I take, should I use this service trailer to restock my parts on, on my truck then or take the service trailer with me? I would think take it with me, right?
trailer's too far away, of course. Take it with me, all right. Repair the twin steer, okay. I'm glad I can't went this way now. <laughs> I was just trying to, that a pickup truck kept getting stuck everywhere, so I figured, well, I might as well jump in this thing, even though it's not good for scouting, but it's better than the pickup truck. Hopefully I don't tip this thing over, because then I'll be screwed. Wow, yeah, so you're already at me where I'm at. I'm at. I think I'm a level 8 right now. But you you played a little longer than me, so you're a little bit... You know where everything's at, plus you know where uh, not to go with certain vehicles, probably. I'm at trial by air right now. I just don't like this high, though. High gear, it doesn't, I mean, I know it's more steady, like you said, but it doesn't drive so much slower. I mean, I'm definitely doing better than I was the first week that I had this game. Cause I don't. I think it's only been two weeks that I've had this. So. Yeah, you play it a lot in hard mode. Be able to scout more easy on the maps. Yeah. I thought it would be easier going through this way, but it seems like it's harder now. Put it in low, maybe? Come on, baby. Low diff lock, yeah. That's why I tried doing it, but it doesn't seem like it's moving very good. I need another tree. Let's see, take that tree over there. This thing don't like to turn very good either. I gotta turn on. I always like turning on my little beacons too. Although they don't, they're not very bright, that's for sure. Oops. Had the parking brake turned on. Yeah, it definitely helps a lot. Low gear. It's like this stuff looks really muddy, but it. Yeah, try and stay on the hard surfaces. Let's see, get over here a little bit. Let's 
see like the lights on top of the truck don't they're not very bright either compared to like, some of the other vehicles If you get to the wa in the water, it will slow you down a bit. Wench it, yeah. So I've been trying to do it. See if I can make it through some of this stuff, but. Slowly but surely. I do like this truck though. It'd be cool if you had the box on there and a uh, crane on this thing. I wish they had a little bit more better selection for colors too. I like this little gray charcoal color, but some of the other colors aren't very great. I gotta run upstairs and alarm's going off for coffee again. We'll get over to that trailer and I'll go upstairs real quick and turn my coffee back on. Not looking forward to going back to work today try to do my Monday route and part of my Tuesday route. Alright buddy, you get some rest and we will catch up with you later. Yeah, that's about what I got, it's about six hours. It's actually better than I thought I was going to get because we were at our neighbor's house for a little bit and supposed to go to bed at 2 and I'm going to bed at 3 so thanks buddy I appreciate it <laughs> all right let's see if we can get this thing fixed up all I need to do is fix it I don't need to tow it do I all right let's back out of here a little bit and I don't know if I could shut the vehicle off and repair it. Let's see. I'm trying to save some of my fuel. Alright, so we need repair. Now we don't want it from the roof rack. So we gotta hit D from the service trailer. There we go. And target is the. We don't want that one. We want that one. What needs to be fixed on it? Oh, not that, not the Chevy. This one. All right. So hit this. Oh, F is repair. Bring this. So now it's fixed, and we should be able to use this thing now. All right. So let's see what we want to do with this trailer, though. Let me just move it out of the way and I'll jump in that truck and see how that truck is. Oh, I need to refuel it too? Ah, oh, crap. I don't know if I'm still close enough or not. Alright, let me back up. Oops.
So I don't know if it could be turned off and refuel it too then. Let's see. Refuel. Source target. We need target is the Western Star. Oh, that. Not that one. Oh, we want source is the wrong one too. Oh, we can't do it from the. So probably have to refuel it from here. Target is the. I did activate the mission, I believe. Yeah, it's activated. Um, do I need to jump in that truck, I think? Oops. So it needs 96 gallons of fuel. I don't think, you can't refuel it from the service vehicle, right? That just services it. What's going on, UXG0? Get, a, get the small trailer, okay. All right, so let me move this tr truck out of the way and I'll drop this trailer off and go get the fuel trailer. Luckily it wasn't too far. I should wonder if I should just wench it over there. That might be too much weight. Yeah, bad idea. That's why I was just thinking like it might be too much weight running through all this again. I'm excited to see what that truck does. I think I've seen you guys drive it before. Um, so I'm hoping it, uh, that'll be a cool truck to have. See, I hit that trailer. Oh, great. Which way do I go? I forget. We need to unlock the all wheel drive upgrade when found later on, on the map. Is it on this map, you think? Or I can't remember. Just want to make sure which way I had to go here. Hopefully I didn't take too much fuel out of it. I thought I had quite a bit in there. It doesn't look like it's a big tank, but it fueled up pretty good. Forgot what map it's on. Yeah, no big deal. I'll find it sooner or later. That's why I'm wondering, like, I should start 900 liters of fuel. Jeez, that's pretty good. All right, you get some rest and I'll see how much I accomplish. I'll try and watch your video again on uh, my lunch break. I, I'm pretty sure I saw some of it. No substitute trailer, oh, I gotta wench this then, yeah. Let's pull forward a little bit. 
hate it when it's right on top of me. See, when you're wenching it like this, the little wheel is still on the ground, so it's digging in the ground, too. Found that out with a semi trailer I tried wenching and didn't know it had wood planks on it, and I was trying to drag it to where I wanted it, and the whole trailer fell over and all the wood fell out of it. Then I had to reload all the wood because I didn't have a trailer with a high saddle or a low saddle, I mean. So we won't be doing that again because that took forever to reload all that wood. There's one in Smithville. Yeah, and I think I haven't gone through all of Smithville yet. I wasn't even planning on coming over here until we kind of made it over here when we got recovered that one truck. And I'm like, well, we're really right here. Might as well try and go in here. Now we've been screwing around this map. Yep, and that's why I'll probably keep it like that too for a while. So I now, ever since I put that crane on that one, I haven't haven't had any. I, I haven't driven it yet. So we started going over here. Find the upgrade in Smithville. Okay. Now we got too many vehicles stuck over here. I wish I had a crane on this. I'd put the tr pickup truck in the back of this truck like you did the other one. All right, let's see. I don't know if I'm too cl if I'm close enough or not. Source is scout vehicle. Target is. Is that the Chevrolet? Is that a Chevrolet? No, that's not Chevrolet. Roof rack, Tartra. It's not giving me the option. I mean, you move forward more. Yeah, it's a twin steer, so I may drag this a little bit closer, maybe. There we go. Oh, now it switched it. I didn't even touch anything. Why did it do that? Hook it up to the the Chevrolet in a second. Yeah, let's let's I'll see if it works this time or not. Yeah, it's not doing it. All right, so let's. Switch, switch vehicles. Hang on, let's turn this off first. Oh, 
Uh, I guess I should have moved forward though. Let's see if it'll do it or not. That's why I get stuck all the time, for sure. Well, I thought this one would be better because... Why is it not hooking up? What is it hooking to? Um... um I thought this truck would be better because it's got all these nubby tires on it and thing sucks. I got myself all in a mess here. Too many vehicles in one spot. Let's see if we can refuel it now. There we go. Yay, 1500 bucks. Too bad we couldn't load this thing up on the trailer, the, tra the truck and the fuel trailer. I'm gonna have to keep driving all these damn vehicles out of here. Wonder if I can. Let's switch trucks. It's got a wench on it. I want to let me switch. That would be cool if I could. Then I can. Then I can, then wouldn't have to keep driving all these trucks all over the place. Oh, this thing don't have no diff lock on it. Diff flag unavailable and oh, and oh, oh, low gear only. Just recover the recover the pickup truck. Oh yeah, this thing ain't gonna get nowhere. Recover all of them, but then then I have to drive all of them back over to. Like I was gonna stay in here in this map here. Try to get some more of this opened up. If I recover them, don't they all go back to Smithville? All right, let's um, cover this one. Keep only the Tatra here. Okay. All right, so I can just leave this in the garage then, right? Hit global map. Go back over to Island Lake. Get in this one. But I want to probably, should I take the trailer with me? Oh, I probably can't retain it without getting the trailer off, I think, is what it happened last time. I can't recover without the, with the trailer on. Yep. <clears throat> oh, I need to retain that other one too, that's right. So let's see.
All right, let's go back over to the other one. All right, so I'm probably want to hook up that service trailer to us. I mean, we still got that trailer sitting there. Damn. Got stuff everywhere now. Maybe I'll just leave that there for now. It just sucks, man. I got shit everywhere again. I'm gonna try and get this watchtower open while we're here, I guess. Upgrade on my left. Oh, way over here. Yeah, I might have to get that once I get around here. Maybe try to at least open up this watchtower. Not that one. I didn't see no other upgrade. Unless there's something hidden somewhere. Oh, open the watch there. Okay. If I'll get to this watchtower, I gotta go get my coffee, otherwise I'm gonna forget it. Turn that thing back on. Alright, let's see where that thing's at. There it is. Well, that should be fun to get to. All right, take it easy, buddy. Get some, get yourself some rest. Appreciate it. Um, I wonder if I can go through here or not. It's an easy one to get to. All right. So let's see what we're looking at here. Back up a little bit. Go back where the fuel trailer was at. Okay. All right, I go get my coffee turned back on. All right, get some rest, Brian. Appreciate it. Have yourself a good night. I'll be right back here, everybody.
All right, we're back here. I keep forgetting I should shut the vehicle off when I do stuff like that, and I'm running more out of fuel every time I do that. All right, let's see if we can get get to that upgrade. This looks pretty swampy over there. I don't know if I'd have made it with this truck. Alright, let's see where it's at before I get too far here. Well, if I should try cut across right here. Looks like it. Not too bad of a spot. this dryer stuff. At least it looks drier. Heavy two custom fit engine power popular vehicle workshop um, not available for this vehicle. I wonder which vehicle it's for. All right, let's shut her down for a second. Let's see what else is on here. Let's probably want to back up and go back the same way here. Maybe we'll grab that service trailer. And the fuel train, see if I could drag it back over, at least somewhere over in here. Looks like there's another vehicle stuck in the swamp there, too. Oh, it's another Chevrolet. Alright, yeah, let's do that. Gotta change the time because I can't drive in nighttime right now. Not until I get a little bit better at this. I don't mind driving in at nighttime when it's doing missions, but not when I'm trying to scout the place out because I don't know these areas very well. I don't know if this is going to be a good idea, but I'm going to try it at least. Get that <coughs> fuel trailer, bring, bring it back over there.
I think that might be close enough we can still get the winch on it. Well, I can't get it on that part, but I can get it on here. Get it there. Let me pull forward a little more. I want to let me attach to this. I don't know if this is going to work or not, but we're going to try it. This truck does have quite a bit of power. Seems about pulling a little closer. See if that works. Definitely going slower, that's for sure. I wish these had cruise control, so I had to keep pushing on the fuel pedal here. This might be too much weight, all this stuff pulling through here. Just try not to leave all these trailers all over the map. If I had a crane, I could put it in the back of this truck that we're driving. if it does any better. We at least got it back over here so that'll be better. Let's bring it over on this side. Definitely burning some fuel, that's for sure. Catch this thing. Let's 
see if we can go get this pickup truck here. Where we gotta take this thing to. Oh, return to the farmhouse. Alright, let's see if we can get it out of here. Hopefully we don't have to back too far in here. And go on the other side of the tree. Alright, let's get a wench out. See where we gotta go to the farmhouse at. Oops, not that. Which one are we on? Rusty Legacy. Where are we at? Ah, we're way over there. Jeez. Gotta take our ways. that farmhouse set again. Man, oh man. You gotta take it quite a long ways. See what we can do with this thing. Oh man, lost the wench. Get some fuel while we're here. Ah, I can't fuel up from it. See if I could change it to roof rack. Can't fuel up that. Oh, it's got. Oh, it's full. That's why. All right. Let's 
get this pickup truck there. Hopefully we should be able to get it there before I gotta go to work. It's moving pretty decent on this. See how how long that lasts. Our truck is going all over the place. A little pickup truck. Once we get done getting this pickup truck back to the farm, then we'll probably be done for the day here. I did forget. Hey, what happened? Oh no, lost our winch for some reason. Um, I forgot they did say we could start early today, so I might actually leave a little early. So I maybe get a head start on today. Oh boy, look at how tight that is going to be. Hopefully our pickup truck will drag itself through.
let's see what we got going on here. Oops. Hey, at least we made it to the house, it looks like. It wasn't as far as I thought. Let's see, where do we gotta take it to, though? All right, another fifteen hundred dollars. All right, well, I think that's gonna be good for today. Might try to actually get to work a little early. I just hate going to work early because then nothing but drunks out in the road. But if I can get a few extra stops done, might be good. I don't have to work Saturday if I get done early this week. So we'll just leave this here and pretty much call it a day. Thanks to everybody who's been watching. Thanks for Brian and Sleepy stopping in and um, hopefully you guys catch me tomorrow. We'll try and do some more or we might be go back to our uh, go back to our um, are cutting down some trees there so you guys have a great night and we will catch you 